uh, Zitter with Voltaging, and before I start my video, I just want to let you guys know that that intro that you guys just watched was done by a guy named Orum. If you guys want to go ask him for an intro, the intros are completely free. They're going to cost you nothing. So if you'd like an intro, be sure to go hit him up. He gets the intro done really fast, and uh, look how it turned out. It looked awesome. The song is going to be in the description. I can't name it off the top of my head. You know, I'm just starting to get used to it, but let's get right into the video. So basically, my friend Exility, you guys might know him. He actually ran into a guy who was level 1000, and he had a Dark Matter Bowie knife. Even though there is no Bowie knife in the game, he actually managed to get a Bowie knife. All right, so this is kind of weird. You know, right off the bat, you can tell something's going on. Obviously, it's not legit if he's level 1000, so you can easily tell something is going on but how did he do it exility and his friend actually managed to get a hold of this guy and you know find out what was going on and how he did it how he did what he did um he actually didn't buy the account surprisingly enough because a lot of people who have level 1000 actually buy the accounts but you know a lot of them don't have a bowie knife so it's kind of odd seeing a bowie knife on this guy's character so basically what the guy said to them is that he had a dev kit ps4 uh, dev short for developer he had a developer ps4 um something that they give it to all developers for black ops 3 where you can basically manipulate the game to your liking it's kind of odd but cool in a sense as well because you know you can do anything he was level 1000 dark matter everything uh dark matter bowie knife even though there's no bowie knife in the game so it's kind of weird uh, a lot of people were kind of confused i'm assuming and he would actually be able to do it to your account too but he'd need your info and to be honest i wouldn't really trust people who ask for your info or people who actually charge because um, either way those accounts are probably going to get banned and, and I'm sure that the dude's account is already banned or it might not be because he has a developer PS4 who knows and so you can actually get a developer PS4 I'm pretty sure if you just go on eBay but trust me they're probably going to cost a lot a lot of money because they don't just hand out these to everyone so it'll probably be really hard to get your hands on one but uh, if you do manage to get one you'd probably be able to do everything that this guy has done but honestly is it really worth it? I don't really think so um, that's basically it. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to drop a like. Um, go hit up Orum if you guys want a free intro. That looks awesome. Um, help me get hit 8K. We are 50 subs off 8K right now while I'm doing this commentary. And yeah, let's go for 80 likes, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace out.